loaded scrambled eggs that even egg haters will love. In this video, I'm going to show you how to make delicious loaded scrambled eggs that everyone will love. Let's get started. You'll need four tablespoons of extra virgin olive oil, two eggs, a half cup of Baby Bella sliced mushrooms, a small onion chopped, a half cup of chopped peppers, I'm using a mix of yellow and red sweet mini peppers, a handful of grape tomatoes, a handful of baby spinach, four breakfast sausage links. I like these Applegate chicken and sage breakfast sausage links because they come fully cooked and don't take a long time to heat up. Four strips of organic bacon and some cheese. I'm using two slices of mild organic cheddar and a tablespoon of shredded Parmesan. For seasoning, I'm using a few twists of Himalayan pink sea salt and grinded black pepper. Plus my secret ingredient, a half teaspoon of oregano. Cooking is easy. First, I place the bacon slices on a rimmed baking sheet covered with foil. I'll bake the bacon at 400 degrees for about 15 to 20 minutes on the middle rack in my oven. Bacon comes out great this way and there's no mess. Just fold up the foil and throw it out. I like mine crispy and I've broken it up into small pieces. Let's set this aside for now. Next, let's scramble our eggs. I know this is controversial, but I like to add a teaspoon of tap water to my eggs and then scramble them quite a bit. This method creates very fluffy eggs in my opinion. Then in a pan, I'll heat the olive oil on medium heat. Then I'll add the sausage, mushrooms, peppers, onions, spinach, and tomatoes. Then I'll season it with salt, pepper, and oregano. I'll give everything a good stir and then put a lid on the pan. I'll let it cook another few minutes, then open the lid and stir. Then I'll pour in the eggs and then give everything yet another good stir. Next, I'll add the cheddar cheese. And the Parmesan cheese. Cover the pan to let everything melt a little bit. A minute should be enough. Finally, I'll remove the lid, add the bacon, And give it one last stir. If you notice some egg on the bottom of the pan, don't scrape it too hard. Leave it behind. Then plate the loaded eggs and serve. This normally feeds two people, depending on your appetite. Just double the ingredients to feed more people. Well, I hope that you found this video helpful. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe.